Hello everyone and welcome back to my playthrough of Persona 3 Reload. Last time we took a little bit of a turning point in the story after we came out of Tartarus and did the, um, the Full Moon boss. Um, on that same night we lost uh, Shinjiro. Uh, Shinji uh, was confronted by Ken Amada who had inadvertently killed his mother years ago, ten years ago to be exact, but they were interrupted by Takaya, the member of Strega, the guy with the no shirt and the fucking hand cannon, the revolver, and he flat out killed Shinjiro. We saw a little bit of the aftermath with the memorial at the school and Akihiko just taking it really pretty hard. But uh, he came, uh, he was able to come, he was, he was able to basically come to terms with it and found a new resolve and his persona evolved from Polydeuces to Caesar. So we'll see next time we go to Tartarus how that plays out. It's basically the same abilities, but it's stronger, I guess. This ba I believe this is the first game where the Personas had evolutions like that. I could be wrong. I never played one or two. I don't know. But it's the, it was definitely present in 4 and 5 as well. Um, we are also, on a brighter note, I guess. <laughs> I guess. Um, about to hit the midterms. So we definitely want to brush up our academics if we can. Um, our stat, we're pretty much all statted out, whoops, we're pretty much all statted out, um, how do we, social stats, here we go, uh, we pretty much have six, in, we have six in courage and charm, just academics we're lacking, and we have to be very, very close, um, So, there's nothing going on tonight. Uh, everyone's pretty much down. Um, when I say down, I mean emotionally. They're just feeling pretty melancholy. I'm not going to take you for a walk, Koromaru. I'm sorry, because that doesn't really do anything. Except give me like an item that I probably won't need. Um, I'm actually going to go to the strip mall. And eat that food. Um, let's make our pilgrimage to the Net Cafe. See if they restocked. Come on in. They have. Okay. And I believe this is the last of it. I believe. Uh, Part-time master. PC software for learning service until it help you earn an hourly wage. So I don't know what this does. Oh, I higher hourly wage. Okay, cool. Muscle trainer. Uh, how to build muscle by using your mind. Cool. And mental strength through expert methods. So, actually, let's head back to the dorm and let's use the computer. So maybe we could do this mental instructor through expert methods, mental strength. I don't know if this is going to raise our academics or SP, but let's see. If it does SP, I'll probably just reload because uh, I want to do the academics. <clears throat> Seems to teach breathing techniques and stretches at varying difficulty levels. I follow the on-screen instructions and begin diaphrag diaphragmatic breathing. This is probably SP. I was able to reach a final level where I could hear my true inner thoughts. I feel like this spiritual training has helped me free my mind. Yeah, SP. Um, yeah, I'm probably going to reload. Um... Let's try the rewind. Ouch. Oh, I don't want 
talk to all these guys again. Sorry, guys. So let's head back there. I'm going to rebuy everything, then I'm going to go to, um, I believe, Wakatsu. Is that what it was called? Uh, this place here. Yeah, Wakatsu Kitchen. Come again. Yep. Come again. Only if you get new shit. Again, I don't know what the difference is. We got the money to spend, so it's okay. Every bite fills my mouth with flavor and my brain with omega 3. Oh, yeah, baby! Get so smart! I will eat at Wakatsu every fucking night if it means I'll get smarter. It's unfortunate, but not many students appear to be saddened by Aragaki's death. Apparently, human relationships are quickly forgotten, though our case is exceptional. The first semester is just a warm-up. The game starts for real during the second semester. You better use the library or study a lot at home. That's true, I forgot we could study at the library, but I think we're okay. The second semester is going to be rough. I'm nervous already. I'm guessing this is Elizabeth. A request? Oh, we got a bunch. Okay, bring me a glasses wipe. Marvelous. Glasses, an object that makes you feel infinitely more intelligent when you don them. There is even an item that helps maintain the pristine quality of the lenses. I believe it is called a glasses wipe. While such an item is not necessary for those who do not wear glasses, it is essential for those who must. I get being new to like certain shit but glasses wipes really just use your fucking shirt man like i would love to get my hand on this glasses wipe would you bring I will one await to me? a report of success i'd like to try sushi if i sushi. may say so ever since the time we met we went around sampling your world's culinary delights my interest in food has been piqued in my quest for more delicacies i came across information about this sushi i love sushi so much I learned that it is eaten during festivities and often offered to the gods at their shrines. This sushi must taste divine, especially if it is in the, the gods' favorite food. I wish to have a bite By myself. All means. Bring me a Mikazuki Mune Chika. Chika. By all means. And the By seventh document. Means. By all means. I don't know what this tile is. <clears throat> I won't insist you do anything, but it'd be greatly appreciated. So eleven one glasses wipe. It has to be very well. I don't think anyone in our group wears glasses. So the culture festival was called off on an account of a typhoon, eh? What a waste. Well, don't be too glum. You got plenty of time to live, so you can wait for the next one. <clears throat> I was thinking of having my older son take the Gekkon entrance exam, but I don't want him to go to a dangerous school. Maybe I should reconsider. You mean the Gekkon student who was caught up in that fight? He died, right? I feel sorry for him. He was too young to die. How could that have happened? Excellent question. So that's just Bunkichi. Is 
Is there no one? There's no way no one's available. Heard about that Aragaki guy who died the other day. You know that place where all the thugs hang out? I heard they were all scared of him there. Yeah, I'm not surprised. He was that kind of guy. This might be a bit insensitive, but you're probably not living a normal life if you get killed like that. That was pretty insensitive. Um, really? I guess because it's the exams there. That's so weird. One here. Wow, okay. You know, might as well go to the library. Yeah, sure. Study. Feel smarter after working on some difficult problems without giving up. What day are we? Are we Tuesday? Yeah, we're Tuesday. Uh, courage to Hello, this is Elizabeth speaking. I'm calling in regard to a recent change in Tartarus. Mm -hmm. It seems that a path that had been blocked off is now open. Really? I thought it prudent to inform you. Well then, Appreciate it. I wish you a safe journey. Thank you. Yep. Story beat. You look half dead. What are you doing out here? When Mom died protecting me, no one believed the truth. To this day, they say she died in an accident that didn't even happen. That's why I wanted to clear the record. I thought that's what she would have wanted. Maybe then she'd finally be at peace. They said he died in some violent crime, right? No one knows the truth. Just like with Mom. And now, I'm going to be left behind. Just like always. The dead are never coming back. You have to accept that. But you still have your life. <sighs> I'm not here to bring you back. You can waste away here if that's what you want. But if you still have the will to fight, then come back and stand on your own two feet. I know that. I've known it all along. I've just been lying to myself. I needed something to hate, to keep myself going. I wouldn't face the thought of being alone, but that's exactly what happened. All this time, I've just been running away. <laughs> All right. I'm not running away. I'm not running away anymore. I swear it. Aragaki-san, I'll see this through to the end. There we go. This persona evolves too. The resolution in Amada's heart has awakened a new persona. Amada's persona nemesis has given rise to Kala Nemi. To Kalima. Revives party, fully restores. Allies HP and will reflect one attack. It's pretty good. Goodbye, Mom. I'll be okay now. 
It's already been a day. Yes. It has. So, where's Sonata-san? He said to leave Amada-kun alone, but... Maybe we should look for him. What do you think? Let's start looking. You think so too? He is still a kid. I can't just sit here. I'm going right now to... Oh, thank goodness. I was so worried. You were? Amado, will you continue to fight? Yes. I'm done running away. That okay with you? Positive. It's all right. We can trust him. Please, don't scare us like that, okay? All right. I'll go and talk to the chairman. You should get some rest. Okay. Hey, not bad. He's a lot tougher than I thought, dude. I'd be so depressed for like three whole days, maybe, or even a week. But he bounced back in just one day. Jeez, that kid's nuts. You have no idea. All right. It seems I praised him accurately. He has the soul of a warrior. I admire his fortitude. Is that? I've confirmed the metamorphosis of two personas, most likely the result of Aragaki-san's death. There may be some more changes to come, so I will remain in observation mode. You do that. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry about what happened. You could have told me no, but you let me come back. I'll make it up to everyone. To Aragaki-san, too. No problem, kid. 1025. Oh my god, we got we got like almost two and a half weeks. Uh, Alright. What are we rank nine with this guy now? Rank eight. I'm kind of tempted to just keep doing academics. Um, what do other people do? Spent time with Tanaka. Nobody went to Tartarus today. I'm going to save again. Um, if if we basically um, just level up academics like doing this, then I'll go back to Tanaka. Oh shit! It's too crowded. Make a call. Just give me the charm. Uh No. Not me. Where was that other uh place that we can order from? Was it here? Umiyushi, yeah. Welcome. Oh, I thought this is where you Thank get the sushi. You. Where do you get the sushi from? Uh, da, da, da. Okay, so I guess it's just studying in my room. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just do Tanaka. <laughs> Uh, 
Uh, shit, what I what I do? No, what did he say? You sure can buy a lot. I must be doing something right then. But I suppose that means the value of a life lesson depends on the learner. Well, this one will be free of charge. Sure. Excellent. I've been waiting for. Ah, never. You mind? That's not important. The other day, a woman came to my office asking for a donation. Quite the looker, I might add. In fact, she was very much my type. But no matter how attractive she was, I was repulsed by her dedication to charity work. You're not gonna donate? Uh, well, if I say no, the tabloids are gonna tear me to shreds. Why should I have to give my hard-earned money to a bunch of freeloaders? I pulled myself up out of squalor to get where I am today. I wanted to get back at the ones who used to laugh at me. That's what I always dreamed of, anyway. But, to tell you the truth, now I have too much money. Profits are booming. I'm so busy, I don't have time to spend a yen of it. Maybe I should train someone to take my place. I could teach them my business philosophy and management techniques. It'd be a carbon copy of me. It would probably cost me a fortune, but if it works, then it's easy living. <laughs> it's true. Hmm. How would you feel about being adopted? Only joking. People would get funny ideas if I took in a child as old as you. President Tanaka looks selfish on the surface, but he seems to care about me deep down. Does he, though? Donate for the sake of the less fortunate, huh? Yeah, you can tell he really cares. pretty chilly tonight. Can you believe it's already autumn? It'll be winter before you know it. You look a little tired. Did something happen? I lost a friend. Oh, you did? In this world, people die every day. Until recently, I thought that was as normal as the changing of the seasons. But now, I understand why people mourn. For the first time, I have a friend. Lately, I've been remembering things more clearly. You recall the end I've spoken of? Some are calling it the fall as well. It's drawing closer each night. Can't you feel it? You and I are like kindred spirits. So, I wonder why I'm the only one who remembers. This is tearing me up. Could it be... That you can't accept me for who I am? Pharos is smiling sadly. Sense of bond between Pharos and me. I mean, there's already been a bond. Rank 8. I'm sorry if I wasn't making any sense today. Maybe it's the change of season. But we're still friends. That will never change. Well... I'll be going for now. Good night. Um, hey! Midterms start next Tuesday. Math is killing me. Sine, cosine, tangent. Yep, yep. Sine, cosine, tangent. Sine cosmos, cosmos sin ten, sin cos cos sin, cos cos sin sin. I have no idea what that is. Huh? What the heck? What kind of spell are you chanting? Midterms start next Tuesday. So we got just under a week. Time to start class. 
Yeah, exams start next Tuesday, but I'd rather spend the time doing experiments. The precise, the precise moment when two chemical agents come into contact? It's so exciting. I'm sure you all find experiments more exciting than just sitting in a chair listening to me talk, right? Well, complaining about it won't do anything for us. Alright, here's a question to get you motivated. Then? How about you, Yuki? Your turn to answer my question today. Which hormone is the one in your brain that provides a sense of achievement? Why, that would be dopamine. Correct. Dopamine's an important hormone that gives us a sense of accomplishment, joy, and excitement. It strives us to motivate. However, if it's overproduced repeatedly, that can lead to addiction. It's the same as other chemicals used in experiments and many things in life. Moderation is key. Make sure you remember that. Um, I'm already charismatic, thank you. I'm as popular as can be. Oh, please. I simply couldn't. You're too kind. Still? I say. Yes, please. You don't want to study for midterms? Uh, where can I get sushi? Can I get sushi from uh, you? It's real tasty. No. By again, yeah. Who's glasses? Unkichi has glasses. No. Um, this guy. Wonder how long my money will last. I'll eventually have to get another job for my wife and daughter, huh? But I can't seem to make the effort. I'm so burned out after what happened. What happened? What happened? Alright, whatever. I say. Yeah. Oh, Yuki. Actually, you got some shopping to do. Wanna tag along? My little bro's been begging me to pick up some new tunes for him, but I don't know much about music. I could really use your help. Sure. Hmm. Great. There's a music store in Polonia Mall, right? You mind going ahead? I'm gonna finish working out first. Shouldn't take long. Hug my heart. Been waiting for a while, but Hayase still isn't here. Let's see. Um, I'll wait a bit longer. Hayase still isn't here. Hmm. Guess I'll kill some time. I see still isn't here. Well, I'll just wait a bit longer. Hello? Sorry, but I don't think I can make it today. Uh don't worry, it's okay. I just feel bad since I'm the one who wanted to hang out. But actually, my mom fainted. I'm at the hospital right now. They said it's exhaustion, since she works from morning till night. Damn it! It's all my fault. And my mom, she's trying to leave. She says we can't afford the medical bills. God damn it! Why can't I do anything? I'm useless. I'm just another one of her problems. <sighs> I'm sorry about all that. I... I don't want to be a problem for you, too. But I'm glad you were the one to hear me out. Talking about this kind of helped. Isaiah is going through some awful times. He opened up to me about it, and I feel like we're closer now. I gotta get back to her room, so... Let's talk later, okay? I've had my mom fan on me once too. It's it's pretty scary. Thankfully she didn't have to go to the hospital, but shit like that shit like that's really oh, scary, man. Back. Oh, he wears glasses. Huh? Need something to wipe off your glasses? I do have something, of course, but 
Ooh, excuse me. But you don't wear glasses. Well, if you're looking for a wipe for eyeglasses, I have a spare. Hang on. Great. Here. It looks dingy, but... Or dingy. But it works very well, in fact. Oh, and here's a little something extra. It's a secret item I was thinking of surprising Haragaki-kun with the next time I saw him. Surely this would get that stoic face of his to break into laughter. Oh well, that was the plan. Mm -hmm. Why don't you take it? I'd be happy if you could put it to good use. Do you have some time? I believe Kirijo-kun told you all about the tragedy that befell Amada-kun's family. It happened after defeating the irregular Shadow. After the dawn of the Dark Hour. Amada-kun probably didn't have any idea what was happening at the time. Amada-kun and Aragaki-kun knew what was going on between them. <sighs> I never expected it to turn into such a horrible tragedy. We shall pray for Aragaki-kun's happiness in the next world. Excuse me. Koromaru-san says that he's in good spirits. If anything, he seems to greatly respect Aragaki-san. Great. Glad to hear it. <laughs> He gave his life to save another. How noble. I'd like to think that I could do the same if it came down to it. How about you? Sure, why not? <laughs> That's an interesting response. Though I suppose quite admirable as well. Uh, upon closer inspection, there's a book called 100 Best Puns mixed in with the complex books. I wonder who's reading it. I wonder. It's probably Aragaki-kun. Aragaki um. He was with us just... He was with us just a short while ago. Can't believe we won't see him ever again. I knew there was always this risk, but... Sorry, I, I'm still a little shaken up. I can't think straight. <sighs> Sorry, I'm yawning while you're pouring your heart out. I think... I said my prayers, so I'll be okay. Grieving over her death and just feeling down are two completely different emotions. So, yeah, I'm okay. Give me a break. Nothing lasts forever, huh? Shinji was satisfied. He got out while he was ahead. Let him rest in peace. We should be focusing on what we need to do now. It was less than a week until the midterms. No one up there. I know, I know, I should be studying. I just can't concentrate. We lost so much, man. Why, Aragaki-san? Hey, um... There's no way I could study right now. I want a close friend just died. I can't just forget about it and move <laughs> on. I just can't do that. Yeah, I hear ya. Might as well hand these in. Good day. Here are my requests. Wonderful. Okay. So this must be the sort of thing one would use to clean a pair of eyeglasses. Fine microfibers, maximum flexibility and absorbency, and an ideal size. It's utterly of perfect. Course. I see. It wasn't just any old rag after all. Hmm? You brought something else with you? May I see that as well? I gave Elizabeth the gag glasses. Here we go. Oh my! What elegance! No resemblance of my master. No <laughs> resemblance of my master. This does leave a different impression. Then let us be off. Well, what do you think? The mustache makes my nose itch a fair bit, though. Not only does it give me a semblance of intelligence, but also one of harmony as well. What a splendid item! Please take this as your reward. Oh, Garnet, thank you. Nothing else? Okay. I got so much shit to do, man. No. Very well. Okay. Let's see if I can eat at Wakatsu. Otherwise, I guess I'm just studying at home. Yeah. Why did you platter, baby? Feel smarter now that I've had some brain food. Who 
needs to study when he could just eat and get smarter. All right, am I right? Right, I'm right. I know I'm right. Oh, Junpei. So, uh, no one's talking about Aragaki-san anymore, now that we have exams. I guess people just worry about their own problems, huh? It's kind of sad, don't you think? I mean, that's life. Well... Guess I'm going back to the library to study. I guess I still quite a bit to go. I thought I would have uh, been a genius at this point. I'm guessing that's the end result. I'm guessing oh, it's, it's you. Yeah, yeah. To be honest, I'm not sure how productive anyone will be trying to study on their own. Well, that aside, try to do your best to study as well. But don't push yourself. Um, I think I'll study. Oh, I haven't checked TV in a while. Today's exchange rate. The current yen is 114.3 yen to the dollar. The yen has gone down by 0.22 since last time. Uh. The air feels kind of heavy. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's you. Sorry, I was just thinking about something. Mm -hmm. Uh, you look like you have something to say. Do you need something? Let's study together. Hmm. Oh, right. Exams are coming up soon. Time marches on without a care in the world, huh? Literally last night you were telling me exams are in a week. Or two nights ago, whatever it was. Hmm. An invitation to study from Yuki is uncommon. Let's take him up on the offer. Akihiko, regarding mathematical proofs, how would you approach this one? Trigonometry, huh? <laughs> this is a fun one. I'd say using the law of cosines here would be the quickest. First, you need to set up an equation. Then, since A and C are prime numbers, you can rearrange it like this and... done. Oh, C'est magnifique! A brilliant method! I thought these kinds of problems were easy for you. Were you just testing me? I didn't mean anything by it. True, I did have in mind a number of ways to solve this, but I found myself wondering about your thought process. I have to say, your speed and accuracy were impressive. Then I'll test you on the next one. Let's race and see who can solve it quicker. Two of them are taking their studies seriously. I should try to focus as well. Oh, it's been quite some time already. We should remember to take breaks. You've got a point. Focusing for too long has diminishing returns. Let's rest for a bit. Well then, why don't we resume in 20 minutes? You can spend your time however you'd like until then. Oh, come to think of it. I haven't gotten any running in today. Guess I'll head out for a refresher. You're leaving the building? You do understand we only have 20 minutes, correct? Even a short workout's a nice change of pace. What were you guys planning on doing? I was thinking of making some tea. What about you? Hmm. I'm wondering if whatever we pick raises a different stat. I think I'll read a book. Ooh, a fine choice. I often read books on my breaks myself. Let's see, why don't I ready enough tea for all three of us? Akihiko, it wouldn't hurt to try reading for a change. <sighs> fine. Guess I'll join you guys this time. 
After the break, we got back to studying. Subtle tension in the air helped me stay on track. I appreciate you inviting us today. You wanted to help take our minds off of recent events, didn't you? <laughs> Did you think we didn't notice? You know, it's usually the senpai's role to do these kinds of things. But we decided to take you up on it. Thanks to this, Akihiko and I were able to get back on our feet. You can expect we'll return the favor in kind. Yeah, we'll help push you as far as your brain can go. Your exams won't know what hit them. For now, let's call it a day. Make sure to get your rest, both of you. That was really nice. Good morning. Morning. Have you noticed? Normally after a successful operation, the number of apathy syndrome cases decreases. However, this time it's the opposite. There's only one shadow left. It must be apprehensive. Yeah, agreed. Yes. If that's indeed the case, then we'll put it to rest with the next battle. In any event, if it weren't for you, we wouldn't be here. So thank you. That's all for today. Did you write that down? You better hurry up. I'm about to erase it. Still writing? Hurry up. What have you been doing this whole time? Texting or something? Exam start next Tuesday, so there's no time to waste. Let's just move on to the next problem. Feeling sleepy? No. Stay awake. I'm moving on now. Did you write that down? Okay, that was more than enough time. I'm gonna erase it now. Really? I'm gonna do it. Oh, and I heard that one of you... I heard that one of you has been counting how many times I say, Did you write that down? How about focusing on your notes? Affirmative. It is rational for students to concentrate on their exams rather than Aragaki-san. However, for some unknown reason, I question the value of thinking like that. I honestly thought I would have maxed out my intelligence by now. Um, should I do Hayase? I really should. Because again, we don't have a lot of time. Like, we do have a lot of time, but it's very limited. Oh, okay, I wish I could grab a bite with you, but I can't today. I actually need to talk to you. Do you mind joining me? Yeah, let's do it. My bad. Thanks, I owe you one. Let's head somewhere else. Maybe the shrine. Thanks for coming all the way here for this. It's no problem at all. Glad to hear that. I wanted someplace quiet to talk. I just came from the hospital. After this... I have to pick my sister up from preschool, go shopping, cook dinner, do laundry. There's still so much I have to do. Sounds pretty rough. It sure is. But I can handle it. My mom had to do all this every single day. Remember how I told you I had a chance to win that scholarship? Turns out I can't practice anymore. I just don't have the time for it. Besides, even with the scholarship, we still can't afford college. I mean, we don't even have enough to survive. We already lost dad, and now mom can't work. It's up to me to earn a living. I have no choice but to give up track. Why'd you have to die, dad? Do I go comforting or do I go aggressive? Let's 
Let's do aggressive. Don't you think I want to? There's nothing I can do! <sighs> Is this... really how it ends for me? Don't give up yet. You're right. I've come too far to give up now. I'm gonna compete. Even if it's my last time, I want to win. I've dedicated most of my life to track and field. It's time to put everything I've learned to the ultimate test. I'm glad we could talk. Everything feels a lot clearer now. Because of you, I have something to aim for. Thanks, man. I helped out Hayase figure himself out. Sister's probably waiting for me. See ya. Part of ways with Hayase. Oh, welcome back. Next full moon will be our last operation, huh? It's kind of surreal. Wait, I've stopped getting distracted. Exams are next week. Ugh, it's hard, it's so hard to focus. A suggestion. I've confirmed that everyone's spirits are low due to Aragaki-san's incident. If this persists, the outlook for our next mission will be poor. We must forge ahead. We must. Nothing interesting on the news. It's an extremely slow news day. Oh? It is. So there's uh, another potential story beat, I guess. Go. Oh, this over academic. Yeah, let's just do this one. I've actually finished my shopping already. Do you have some time now? I want your help for something. Should I spend the evening with Sonata? Let's do it. Thanks. Let's head back to the dorm together. Oh, crap. I forgot to buy eggs. Sorry, but can you go back first and make sure that no one uses the kitchen? I'll meet you there in a bit. Don't worry. I won't keep you waiting long. I on my feet than you are, you know. Looks like Sonata's in here yet. Sorry I'm late. I ran into some unexpected trouble. All right, here goes. Back me up, would you? I'm going to make pancakes. Think you can help? I guess you could say I've got a craving. I used to eat them all the time at the orphanage. I know they sell frozen ones nowadays, but nothing beats freshly cooked, right? Okay. I don't know about you guys. I've made pancakes. I'm not the greatest at making pancakes, but I know how to make pancakes. How many pancakes are you expecting to make? Look at how many cartons of milk, how many eggs, and how much pancake mix you have. Like, one box can easily make, like, I don't know about 100, but, like, at least 50 pancakes. At least. Fuck, man. That, that's a lot. You're, you're going to be here all night. You are literally going to be there all night. It, yeah, you're making a lot. You think so? I just thought more would be better than less. Well, let's go on and get started. Okay, uh, first things first. And it's not like there's enough space in the fridge either. I can't even fit a fucking Taiyaki in there. It's probably like, what, like that, that big? You're gonna fit like 150 pancakes in there? Uh, what exactly do we do first? Oh, jeez. Uh, I, I think the recipe said to use lots of butter and to regulate the pan's temperature with a damp washcloth. Wait, we put a washcloth in the pan? Won't it burn? I've never done that before. Please just let me handle it. <laughs> you sure? 
Thanks. I don't know how to cook anything besides the stuff I use for bodybuilding. I can break the eggs and mix the batter. I'll leave the actual cooking part to you. Okay. Oh, so that's how you use the washcloth. How about we add some protein powder? Hey, don't look at me like that. Oh, <laughs> I'd better go get the plates. All right, I think this will be enough. You think? Oh, check it out! Wow, look at all the pancakes! I knew something smelled good! Yeah, just give me a minute. We can eat once I bring them out. Would you mind getting everyone else? <laughs> and don't forget Amada. Okay. okay! Oh, it's like a Tartarus of pancakes! Did the two of you make all of these yourselves? Yeah, although this guy was the one who cooked them. I said I had a hankering, but we might have made too much. I like pancakes, but no way I can eat all of these myself. If you guys could pitch in, that'd be great. The Rock wishes he had a cheat day for pancakes like this. I mean, it look, I, I'm hankry for pancakes now, I'll be honest, but even with, what, nine people and a, and a dog? Eight people and a dog? Good luck. So you like pancakes too, Sonata-san? Thank you. I can't wait to have some. I'll make some tea. I've got some leaves that'd be great for the occasion. Pancake and it's tea? pancake party time, as they say. Oh yeah, they definitely Whoa. say that. Mm. Mm. The These flavor brings a smile to my face. I can eat them all day. Oh, yeah? and okay. Here. What are you, the chairman? <sighs> Thanks for the pancakes. They were really good. What did I just say? The difference between pancakes and hotcakes? I don't know. Even wheat cakes. I guess wheat cakes are probably just... They use different uh, ingredients. Instead of pancake mix, maybe wheat-based? I don't know. No idea. Tasted like a lot of care went into them. If you ever make some again, I'd like to help out too. For as many as we made, they sure did disappear fast. Cooking's not really one of my strong points. A certain someone would always say, if you pour protein powder on the ingredients, then you shouldn't be in the kitchen, dumbass. Most of the time, I only ever got to watch someone else cook. So I never really learned myself. Anyways, thanks for helping out today. I'm hoping that cheered everyone up a little. What made you want to do this? They did things like this back when I was at the orphanage. I just wanted to recreate it. My sister used to cry all the time there. But the pancakes always brought a smile to her face. Hm. Do you remember that medal you found in the package for my parents? My sister, Miki. She made that back when we were at the orphanage. Based on the letter that came with it, I guess my parents found it when they were cleaning. Miki was going to give that to me after we learned I was getting adopted out and leaving. But then that fire happened right after. And this medal was all that was left of her. Sorry to hear that. Apparently, Miki used to always say she wanted to thank me for being so strong and kind. She was really quiet, and she'd always be following me around. I don't really remember doing anything special for her, but I guess she was relying on me as her older brother. Seeing that medal made me think, would my sister be proud of who I am now? Am I really strong and kind enough to deserve that medal? If I'm being honest, I don't really know what it means to be strong or kind. Everyone who's ever said that to me has left without telling me the most important part. You saw how I was today. This is all I'm capable of right now. I haven't grown at all since I was a kid. <laughs> They'd laugh if they saw me now. That's not true. Maybe my sister would say that. But you know not everyone would cut me that much slack. I realized I'd just been running away all this time. Making excuses about having my own problems. But from now on, I'm gonna protect it all. 
We promised we'd become strong together. I won't let him down. I'll help whenever you need. <laughs> Thanks. I really appreciate that. I'll be counting on you next time. <laughs> the point of this whole thing was to cheer everyone up. And yet I'm the one getting supported here, you know? I think you're the kind of person my sister would have looked up to. All right, that's enough talking about the past. Let's hurry up and finish clean. <sighs> Are you hurt? Well, I ran into that group of punks on my way home from shopping today. There were even more of them this time. And one guy managed to get a good hit in. Don't worry, though. I didn't do anything that would get me in trouble with the police. I just let them throw as many punches as they wanted until they got tired and gave up. I thought I could dodge them all, but... Uh, <laughs> I guess I've still got room to improve. Finished cleaning up with Sonata, then went back to my room. Sure. I'd rather my academics. I learned how to make pancakes. Even though apparently I knew how to make pancakes. All right, all right. Oh, God. All right. Get ready for a ramble, folks. Okay, time to get started. Exams are coming up. Ready for today's lessons? Aha Adonai Tetragrammaton. We've covered the time of magical growth and just about reached the modern age. And just as every art or science branches off into sub-studies as it progresses, magic began subdividing around the 18th century. Some people preached of morals, some focus on communicating with spirits, etc. There was even the man who founded modern psychology based on his research into hypnosis. This too is magic, the ability to see into the human mind. As a result of magical researches flourishing, witch hunts grew more common. To avoid this, the practice went underground to secret societies. I'm sure many of you have heard the names of at least some of these organizations. The Rosicrucian Order, the Freemasons, the Illuminati, the Golden Dawn. Interestingly enough, many of these societies are still with us today. As for the forefathers of modern magic, they are simply too numerous to count. For instance, there is El Eliphas Levi? El Eliphas Levi? A man who attempted to combine modern and ancient systems of magic. His literature, which took a scientific approach, is still being published to this day. Madame Blavatsky was a renowned magician of the 19th century and the figurehead of theosophy in her time. Many magical societies stemmed from the Theosophical Study, sorry, Society, which Blavatsky founded with a few close associates. Franz Mesmer opened a path into psychology in his studies on life energy. And Rudolf Steiner, once a member of the Theosophical Society, founded anthrop Anthropophosy, am Anthroposophy, which he called a spiritual science. Anthroposophy never heard that term before. There was Aleister Crowley, that name I have heard. Of course, the 20th century's most well-known magician. And George Gurdjieff, a mystic who taught his many students the fourth way, also known as the work or the system. Each of them was a living archive of esoteric knowledge. Are you still hearing me? Not frozen with fear, I trust. Allow me to test if you're paying attention. Get it wrong and your sign will change. Okay, then. Uh, uh, Yuki. Who was the founder of Theosophy, a group that gave rise to many other magical societies? That was Blavatsky. Good. Very good. Remember to get blessed on your unlucky years, though. At any rate, the magical arts progressed even further with their practical use. Thanks to the archiving and proliferation of these arts by the people we've covered today, Respect. 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 
Okay. So I think I can actually get paid while raising my academics. Where does this guy work? That Aragaki died, died on the gang spot, right? Sometimes I'll aimlessly wander around there, but I should quit doing that. There's a Mahjong parlor in the gang spot, and one of the guys there is a Mahjong demon. He said, let me test my luck and challenge me to a game. I came pretty close, man. If I'd gotten the peacock, I could have beaten him. If only you got the peacock. Yo, this had nothing to do with us. Got it? We weren't even here. I know how it looks to guys like you on the outside. But I just don't give a shit about people if they just stay out of our faces. One of those Geku dudes. Yeah, Aragaki. I heard he got in some kind of accident and died. I heard it happened here, too. I don't care much what goes on around here, but... Thinking about this being the place where he was killed really creeps me out. So I guess he would have gone this way. Go elsewhere. Because uh, this is where Shinji died, right? And Takaya... Uh, yeah, Takaya just, like, went around here. I guess he could have just gone in there. Anyways... Back to the movie cinema. Uh, might help my academics, eh? Would it be two? Sure. This must be the method the culprit used to seemingly vanish into thin air. I see. The statute of limitations ran out three years ago, but with modern technology, we may be able to shed some light on this case. Perhaps. But it's just as likely we may never discover the truth, like the past 127 cases. 127 cases you never found out the truth. Fantastic work, detectives. Seeing someone earnestly pursue the truth helped refine my academics. Two of them, beautiful. I hope we're getting close, man. I hope we're getting close. I see you're back. Monday's a holiday, so we have the next two days off. Just one shadow left, I'm starting to get fired up. We've come this far. So we can't lose now. Let's train as much as we possibly can. Let's make him proud. Um, fuck. No one's studying today. Um, um. Uh, have you been studying for the exams? Sometimes I can't stop thinking about Aragaki Senpai. No. Even though I know you shouldn't be dwelling on what happened. Right now we just have to focus on our midterms. How's work? I realize it may be difficult given recent ex events. Have you been studying for the exams? You, we just studied two days ago. Yes. I see. Good. Keep it up then. I think. Uh. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yes. One more shadow left. Lots happened, but the next one is the last. We finally made it. For us, there's nothing left except winning. Try to keep it together. All right. Um. Are the others upstairs? Uh, we are Saturday, which means academics. Or I could go here and get academics. Maybe it's something in ingredients, but I feel a little smarter. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little worried, you guys. Exams are coming up. 
Almost time for the home shopping show. It's amazing! I'm gonna do it. I'm going to do it. Juicy seasonal gift sets. Pears are in season right now. You don't think they're pretty hard to peel? Good, good. But with the paring knife, the pear's skin will come right off. Oh my goodness, it's wonderful. But wait, there's more. Not bad, kid. Throw in this candy hosui pear too. Guess how many? Two. 20,000. Mm, no. Bang? Buh -buh. Sure, we can get a better item later on. Uh, yeah, we're not gonna go there. We're gonna go there. We're gonna talk to Akinari. Can you guys just fucking make up already? See that guy over there? Oh, you see that guy over there, right? You know, the one who's been following me? I don't know how to get rid of him. So I guess he'll, I'll just let him do whatever he, it is he's doing. Or he could tell him to fuck off. Isn't she awesome? Maybe I'll just keep checking her out a little while longer. Great, great place to do it, by the way, guys. Right in front of a shrine. No. <laughs> if you don't mind, please stay until I've caught my breath. I got my Thunderbird. Yeah, let's do it. to settle down, I think. Thank you for coming. It's comforting to have someone with me. Why do I have to face this alone? Why am I the one? I can't run around like I did as a child anymore, because my legs and heart won't even let me. All that's left is to draw my sheets around me and count the beats of my heart until they stop forever. Why is this only happening to me? You aren't alone. Sure, there are plenty of people dying in this world. But so what? What does that have to do with my death? Where is there meaning in any of this? I wish I could run away. But if my body were capable of that, I wouldn't be here anyway. No matter what I do, my body is there to remind me I'm going to die. Why? Why me? <coughs> Please don't leave just yet. It's almost too much for me if I'm alone. Let's talk too much. <laughs> yes, you're right. But... I'd still like to talk for just a little longer. I'm feeling a little better now. Thank you. Our presence is comforting to Kamiki. It's starting to get dark. Don't worry, I'll be fine now. I hope I can see you again soon. Welcome back. The after tomorrow, periodic examinations begin. How are your preparations progressing? That's a lot of peace. Until recently, I had been reserving my energy for the final battle. However... According to Mitsuru-san, studying for exams is a crucial component in preparing for the future. Therefore, while I may be off to a late start, I will now initiate study mode. Good luck. Um... By the way... We have tomorrow off for health and sports day. But since it's the day before midterms, I'll probably just be studying the whole day. What is it? Something in sports day? 
Maybe I'll squeeze in a walk or something. It's not good to focus too much on only one thing. Um. Sorry, what was it? By the way. Health and sports day. What the fuck is it? You get a day off for health and sports day? On the next episode of Phoenix Ranger Featherman R. Episode 34, Hawk Snooze Too Much. He must be woken up with the ultimate technique, Superconductive Cyclone. On to other news. The fuck are you wearing, dude? So, um... To be honest, I was planning to go to that spot today. Then I decided not to. If I keep living in the past, I'll never be able to move forward. On that note, I'll be right back, guys. All right. Sorry about that. Nature called, and I have to answer. All right, let's study. Excuse me. I've heard that high school students engage in a social event called a study group before exams. Such an activity may allow us to learn more about one another. This is permissible. Let's do yes. it. Roger that. Allow me to retrieve my textbooks and other studying materials. I mean, don't you have it in front of you? I have detected a gaze upon us for an estimated seven minutes now. Oh, sorry. I just wanted to watch. Was I bothering you? <laughs> yeah, I could stare too. No, nah, don't worry about it. Thanks. I was just curious what it's like to study for an exam. Um, is it alright if I study with you? If it isn't too much trouble, I mean. My data states that elementary school does not feature regular examinations. Is this information inaccurate? No, you're right. We don't really have tests that we need to study a whole week in advance for. Sorry, um, if you're not okay with it, I can just... Come study with us. Oh, thank you. I'll go get my workbooks now. Next question. What is the term used to describe the property of having zero electrical resistance? Oh, I know! Superconductivity! Correct, Amada-san. Nice work, kid. Superconductive Cyclone. Yeah, that's it! The Featherman Technique! It's so cool! I mean, that's what I heard from a friend, anyway. Oh, sorry, Koromaru. I guess I was being a little loud. Let's get back to studying. We all started taking our studies seriously. I feel like I'm focusing better than usual. It appears that Amada-san has entered a state of non-REM sleep. He is in a deep slumber. Sleeping here may cause his body temperature to decline sharply, risking illness. Shall we wake him? Let's carry him to his room. Understood. I wonder what kind of dreams Amada-san will have. Who sleeps in a deep sleep Let's like that? Let's transport him carefully to prevent waking. I will accompany you on the way to his room. Today's health and sports day. No school. Um, run entrance, no. By the way, exams start tomorrow. Looks like you're all serious about doing well on them. I too will be implementing the take my chances approach on where to focus for doing my studies. there no one's there um okay so
I wonder if I have, if I could have Wakatsu in the morning. Uh, yeah, I guess so. Let's do a quick save. So I gotta maximize the the two notes, right? As as opposed to the one note. Come on, baby. Terms start tomorrow, but we can't simply ignore what happened. It's difficult to focus on studying at such a time. However, it, it would be unwise to ignore what's right in front of you as well, cold as it may sound. I'll try to think of something to help everyone focus on the exams. How about study group? There is a study group. Lucky color for Sagittarius is pink. For extra luck, try putting a flower on your door. Okay, good to know. Let me rock the world. Okay. Let's do it, Mitsuru. Mm -hmm. It seems some of us are having trouble focusing on studying for the exams. So I was thinking of holding a study group for all of us. What do you think of that? Good idea. Precisely. So you agree? Then it's settled. I'll ask everyone to gather immediately. When you're ready, wait for me at the table over there. I'll see you in a bit. Right then. I decided to hold this study session for us to concentrate on the upcoming exams. Amada, I invited you to join us so you can focus on your own studies. Your presence is welcome here. Thank you for inviting me. I'll make sure not to be a bother to everyone. To the rest of you, I want you to set a proper example and take your studies seriously. Are you going to study with us, Korochan? Good boy! Koromaru-san says that he will accompany us here as we study. Well, aren't you a little hard worker? Unlike Junpei over there who can't stop yawning. <sighs> I can't really deny it. Wouldn't mind being in his place right about now. Dogs never have to study for exams like this. Man, what a life. Shake, Junpei. Being a dog isn't easy. He is glad that you understand. Koromaru-san never misses a day patrolling the neighborhood, after all. You hear that? Think you could keep that up every single day? Damn it. The dog wins again. Koromaru-san may not have an obligation to study, but he has another important mission. True. He's been protecting that shrine this whole time. That sounds like something far more difficult. Guess if you want to be a dog, you'd better develop some diligence, like Koromaru here. I probably focus on studying Being a dog now. is harder than it seems. You'd be better off just studying, Junpei-san. Oh, stop! Don't look at me like some pitiful creature! All right, that's enough chit-chat. Let's concentrate on our studies. Knowing everyone's watching keeps me accountable. Yeah, three, baby! It was not enough. All right, I think we can begin wrapping things up. Good work, everyone. And Iori. After all the dog talk, I do hope you were able to get through the material you needed to cover. Uh... Wolf? Oh, I see. So you're still learning, then? As a dog, I'll need to give you strict behavioral training. Yeah, I'm kidding! It was a joke! I'm totally cool being human. No training needed! I'm good! That will conclude the group study session. It is time for a much-deserved rest. I should still be able to get top of the class, I think. I'm pretty sure. 
or top of the grade, whatever it is. Second semester midterm exams begin today and will last for five days. Here we go. This question seems familiar. Hormone dopamine is related to our sense of accomplishment. Name a symptom of its overproduction. Uh, addiction. I have a feeling this is the right answer. This question seems familiar. Who is considered by many to be the first numerologist whose name lives on today in mathematical theorem? Uh... Pythagoras? Pretty sure it's Pythagoras. I have a feeling this is the right answer. Oh, gotta love that flute. This question seems familiar. What happens when electrical resistance reaches zero? Hint. It was the word I used to confess my love to someone. God. Superconductivity. Okay. What is the meaning of the phrase to spill the beans to reveal a secret? The last day of exams. Questions are just the too easy. My pen won't stop moving. Fuck yeah, baby! Finish today's exams. And everyone's opened up their availability again. This time, I know we did pretty good. I can't wait for the results. Yeah, everyone's there. Okay, let's do some Yukari. Hey, so... S so about the other day, and by other day I mean weeks ago. Sorry, um, do you have time right now? I'd like to talk things out with you. Sure. Thanks. Can we go to the rooftop? Absolument. Hey. Hey. You remember when those guys stole my wallet and you came to help me? Like, hi. Like the Joker. Um, sorry I got so mad at you. I was just frustrated. I don't like having to depend on other people. But it ended up happening anyway. You know, I couldn't say it at the time. But I'm actually glad you came. Maybe because it's... You. So... I want to thank you properly. Oh? Thanks for your help back then. I really appreciate it. Thank you, too. <laughs> what are you thanking me for? Yukari seems relieved to have gotten that off her chest. You appear to be growing up even closer. a big weight off my shoulders. Let's head back down. But couples oh, tend to sneak up here. What is the she roof like? doesn't get a lot of foot traffic, so I think it's a good place to have serious conversations. But couples tend to sneak up here too. If anyone sees us, the rumor mill might go crazy again. Uh, hey, uh, hey, uh. Here too. If anyone sees us, the rumor mill might go crazy again. Wouldn't that be annoying? <laughs> you know. If people assumed we were dating. I wouldn't mind. <laughs> really? 
I'm not sure if you're being brave or oblivious. Still, that's something special about you. You don't get bogged down by what other people think. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> they say a sneeze means someone's talking about you. <laughs> well, it's probably nothing. Or sign you're home, getting yeah? sick. Or you gotta blow your nose. Could be a sign of many things. Welcome back. What's up, dude? Whew, the five days from hell are finally over. Yo, you wanna head to old Tartar tonight? I'll think about it. Nice. Alright, I gotta get exams off the brain, you know. Um come to think of it, the crops I planted on the rooftop should be ready to harvest by now. Yeah, we'll head up there. How's everything going? Considering what you've all been through, you did an excellent job on your exams. Should all go out and enjoy the weekend. Salut. <laughs> I was worried about how the loss of Aragaki would affect the rest of the team. It seems everyone's not letting it deter them. He must be smiling down on us from above. Or scowling me like fuck at school. I don't gotta do shit. By the way. I don't feel relieved like I usually do after exams. Do you? Uh I feel or wait. I don't feel relieved like I usually do after exams. Oh, she doesn't feel. Really. No, I don't either. <sighs> yeah. Our final operation's coming up. I'm not really sure how to feel. It took a minute for me to process what she was actually saying for some reason. So she's not relieved like she normally is. Because she's nervous. Um. Oh, hello. Finally done with exams. I don't think I did very well this time. I had a hard time remembering some terms and formulas. How do you think you did? Uh, same as always. That's great. And I guess you don't have to worry about your grades. The cultural anthropologists have calculated another date. They say the next apathy syndrome victims will begin to appear in one week. Yeah, I will wait. To go into Tartarus until all three people have gone in. Excuse me. My favorite subjects are tactical theory, mechanical engineering, and information analysis. Unfortunately, the examinations did not cover these subjects. Therefore, regarding the results of the exams, I will be, as Junpei san will put it, in deep shit. Uh. Well said. We don't have exams in elementary school, but I'll have to take them in middle school. Are they difficult? Mm, not really. Oh. Really? Wow, that's good to hear. Um. Mind your own biz. Uh, it's pretty good workout. I didn't think I'd get into this. Um. Oh, I can't go with him. Yeah, I should harvest those first. Yeah. I have to... I can't harvest with someone, unfortunately. Or... Yeah, harvest. Okay. Wow! No, don't plant. Oh, it's a... I thought it was like the big spinach one. Only five? Well, better than nothing. You know, I think I will plant tonight with Junpei. Actually, hang on. He's not gonna get anything more out of this, right? No. I see. Yeah. We will do the soul spinach. Plant it. Right. Junpei's hard at work. Attended the rooftop planters with Junpei. Not exactly huge, 
but what we lack in size will make up for in numbers. I'd say that's some mighty fine work. Let's head back downstairs. I got a text message. Downtime. Good morning. Been feeling the burnout starting to creep up on me, so I'm gonna take some time for myself and go out. I know you're probably busy. Um, maybe. Well, s no, actually, it's Sunday. It's a meat. I'm going to do it. An assortment of instant food. Too busy to whip up a full meal? Or maybe you've got a hankering for some quick and easy? Good, good. How about some instant curry? And five of them to boot. A must-have pantry item. And it says an SP item. But wait! There's more. Not bad, kid. We'll throw in this instant ramen. Guess how many? Ten. Or five thousand? It might just be teners. Like only like the SP might only heal ten. The HP might only be like 20 or something. Um, why not? It's always good to have extra SP items. Thanks, kid. Next time we'll be introducing a Halloween fun set. Bye bye. Bye bye. Oh hi. Hey. Is the machine in the command room still acting up? Oh. Yes, it hasn't been repaired yet. Mm. So we don't know the cause. Then how we know we, how we ever fix it? Mm. I'll check it out later. If you have time for it, could you check it out too? Oh, right. So how did you do on how did you do on your exams? Uh, I did well. Oh. Excellent. Great talk. On the next episode of Phoenix Ranger Featherman R, episode 35, Passenger Pigeon Romance. Fight for your sickly love, Swallow. On to today's news. Um, let's go to the command room. Let's watch this new video. Oh, there are no new recordings. Oh, no. You lied to me. Ah, it's you. Would you like to talk with me again? But only if you're so inclined, of course. Seems like Kamiki would enjoy my company. Yeah, let's Thank do it. You. I suppose I've actually been waiting for you. I'm doing better today. I know it probably looked dire last time, right? Sorry if I scared you. I'd been reading a book before we met that day. I guess I got so absorbed in it that I didn't realize how cold the wind was. Do you enjoy reading books? I'd say so. I see. That's something we have in common then. I actually do like reading Nowadays, books. Nowadays, reading books is all I do. I actually don't... To be fair, I don't read as much as I used to, but I do listen to a lot of books. Uh, I do spend quite a bit of time driving. I love driving, too. And I generally listen to audiobooks or podcasts uh, whenever I drive, instead of music. I tend to listen to music more at home whenever I'm doing stuff. But generally, audiobooks or podcasts in the car. I find that they give me a way to escape everything else. I can just get lost in the book's private world. Do you read books all the way through? Of course I do. Oh, you do? I don't like to see them end. The more engaging a story is, the more I want to get lost in it. But I'm always afraid to finish it. Because once I finish the story, I'll have to come back to reality. This inescapable body of mine. 
heartwarming stories filled with hope. Those are the kinds of books I like to read. They give me a little solace when I have to come back to the real world. Kamiki smiled weakly. Oh. Uh, I feel like our relationship is stronger now. Okay. It looks like the sun is already setting. Time is so ruthless. I hope we have another chance to talk. Me too. Part of ways with Kamiki. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. More coffee? Oh. Uh, nope. That was oh, a bad time. That was a bad time, kid. Well. What to do after the dark hour disappears? We cannot answer that question. I was built solely to eliminate shadows. Once that mission has been fulfilled, there is no reason for me to remain active. If I may speak. Thus, the disappearance of the dark hour does not concern me. What? Dude, I guess. Uh -huh. You didn't have to put it that way. It's kind of depressing to hear you say that. I thought he was wearing a beret for a minute. I'm like, that didn't seem right. Yeah. I'm just going to sleep when the dark hour disappears for good. Because it's freaking exhausting fighting in Tartarus. I just want a good night's sleep for once. A nice, peaceful sleep. Sounds good. I'd like to get some beauty sleep too. My skin could use a little TLC. Well. With a little maintenance, my body would look as good as good as new. Would you like to join me for some maintenance, Yukari son? What? Uh yeah, no. I don't think that's possible. Alrighty. So what to do? What to do? Um, I could try leveling my academics, but there's no point. I'm sure I'll naturally raise it all the way up uh, through the game. Um, I think I'll just try and go through everything here. Um, yeah, we'll do the mental instructor, get the extra SP, because why not? Perfect. I'm surprised no one's gone into Tartarus yet. Hey, the exam results are up. That was quick. I scored the highest of my grade. There you go. Everyone's looking at me with respect. Come to think of it, Mitsuru promised to give me a gift if I scored well. I should talk to Mitsuru when I see her. Lunchtime's almost over. I should get back to class. And it becomes this. Then round up like this, and the answer is x equals 1. Hmm? It isn't? Oh, I see. This becomes 11. So x equals 2. Hang on, what? Okay, uh, your assignment is to figure this one out. Anyway, wasn't that fun? Numbers are so interesting. Even with a difficult problem like this one, once it's solved, it becomes such a simple concept. Our entire reality is made up of numbers. Civilization owes its very existence to math. And then... All right, you seem like a you seem like a math fan. Here's a question for you. We use the number zero a lot. Do you know where it originally came from, though? Uh, it came from. I want to say Egypt, because I know, if I remember correctly, um, zero came from Arabic numerology first, if I'm remembering correctly. And Egypt speaks Arabic. But I think it might have also been India. I don't believe it was Rome. 
I'm gonna say Egypt. Oh, too bad. Too bad. It is India. Yeah. It's fascinating how someone just up and conceived the concept of emptiness one day. Thus, with the birth of Zero, all of mathematics took an enormous leap forward. Ah, the beauty and wonder of it all. Math is magnificent. I answered incorrectly. That's okay. I, I had a feeling it was India. I was happy with my score. All that studying I did during summer vacation paid off. Oof, what a relief. I didn't do too badly. My scores will never go up if I don't take things more seriously. I'm going to study as soon as I get home. You do that, man. You do that. Nothing going on anywhere. Okay. Hey there. Oh, hey. Looks like we're finally done with exams. Man, I'm beat from all that studying. And I'm sure you are, too. Let's give ourselves a pat on the back. Oh, by the way, are you walking by, back by yourself? I'll come with you. Uh, I don't think our bond will grow. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. We'll spend some time. We'll stop by Chagall. <laughs> Chagall coffee. <laughs> and then what happened? It's like, ha 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 ha. And then what happened? Oh, welcome back. Thank you. Your exams are over, right? If you decide to go to Tartarus, I want to go too. I promise I'll do everything I can. I'll be fighting for him too. Actually, that's another question. Can I just sell his his weapons? <sighs> Oof, no Fs. Now I don't have to go to Aragaki son's grave and tell him I failed. Excuse me. I perform satisfactorily in chemistry and mathematics, but I perform poorly in other subjects. But since I specialize in combat, these results are not unexpected. I mean, aren't you in a, a walking encyclopedia? Couldn't you just, like, flip through encyclopedias, scroll through Wikipedia for, like, a week and, like, know everything? Um, um. Have you seen the exam results? Mine actually weren't as bad as I thought they'd be, but I feel like I could have done much better. Made me realize that I'm still stewing over all sorts of things. Have to keep it together. Hmm. Aiga's son said she didn't do so well on her exams. Maybe some academic specs had to be sacrificed to make her over-specialize in combat. I guess robots have their own share of problems too, huh? Okay. Well, the exam results have been posted. Now that we don't have that hanging over our heads anymore, let's focus on Tartarus. The next operation will be our last one, so let's put her all into preparing for it. By the way... How are your results for the exams? Mine were the usual. Well, we can't be wasting time worrying about exam results right now. Our priority should be to train as much as we can for the final battle. So we got about two weeks left for that, eh? Let's see what's on TV? There's nothing interesting. Uh, it doesn't seem like Koromara will game anymore. Yeah. Not now. Yeah, well, wine, wine. Mitsuru. I'm guessing she's upstairs. Oh. Saw your exam results. Good work. Here, this Excellent. is from the chairman. It's a reward for effectively balancing schoolwork as well as our extracurricular activities. Thanks. Since I placed the top of the exams, I also got this pendant of unity. Unity. Raises attack when the wearer is on the receiving end of a shift. Cool. Hmm. Um. You know what? Yeah, because I I still want to level up her. Um. Not level up. Get her new characteristic. In that case. All right, I'll grab that book for you. Do you ever feel encouraged reading about the influential figures of the past? 
Even leaders who forged great nations faced the challenges of interpersonal relationships. I feel that. Or... No. Something on your mind? Well, it's natural to consider things, isn't it? Oh, were you expressing concern for me? Thank you. Sorry, I didn't mean to distract from our reading. Shall we get back to it? Oh, look at the time. I think that's enough for today. That was a pleasant time together, hearing nothing but the sound of each other's pages. By learning about the exploits of renowned individuals, my academics have improved. I'd like to hear your thoughts on our reading again sometime. But for now, good night. Did I skip something? No, I didn't. Tuesday. All right, time for class. I know you've been busy lately, but you all remember to do your homework, right? Just because you're not taking a humanities class next year doesn't mean you can blow off classic lit. Hey, are you all listening to me? <sighs> What's wrong, Fuka? You look kind of down. Huh? Talk to me. What's bothering you? It's just... Aragaki senpai Oh. Yeah, it's pretty shocking. I'd never seen him in school, but he'd always be hanging around town. And now he's just... gone. It's hard to put it into words. I took it for granted that everyone would always be around, that nothing would ever change, but... some things you can never get back. I didn't consider how easily it could happen. Once I realized that, I started thinking about my parents. I've sort of been avoiding the question, but... Is it okay for me to leave things with them like this? Parents, huh? Yeah, that's a tough one. But I think you'll work it out, Fuka. Moriyama, what are you waiting for? Come on up. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> Would it kill you to give your classmates a proper goodbye? Huh? What's going on? Um, hi everyone. I know I haven't been here that long, but I feel like I've made some good friends. I'll remember each and every one of you after I transfer. Thank you all. How's that? Uh, wait. Transfer? What? Good friend. Not even telling her she's being transferred. You're a weird one, you know that? The biggest bitch in school is leaving and you're gonna miss her? You're transferring and you didn't say anything? It's not like it would have made a difference. Why make us both depressed? But yeah, my dad suddenly collapsed. And they say it'll take a while for him to recover because of some complications. We don't really have that much money, so we can't afford to stay in this area. <sighs> you know, now that I think about it, you're the only one who bothered being friends with a weirdo like me. But like I said before, we're both in the same boat. My parents act like I don't even exist. I hate living with them. That's why I was so jealous when you moved into the dorm. That's Kichan. You know, you've really changed, Fuka. You're a lot more cheerful now. But why'd you move when your house is, like, right here? Huh? Well, um... If you don't want to say, that's okay. I'm sure you've got your reasons. But if it's something that you and your parents can work out, then do it while you have a chance. It'll be a while before my dad's in any condition for us to have a heart-to-heart. What am I doing? This isn't what I wanted to talk about. You know, Fuka, I used to think every day was just the same depressing routine. 
And I'm only saying this because it's you, but you don't really get many second chances in life. Natsuki-chan. <sighs> I guess this is the last time I'll see this view. I won't be in school next week because I'll be packing, so... I guess this is goodbye. No! <laughs> Don't you dare come see me off. I want to say goodbye on my own terms. <sighs> Come on, don't give me that look. But you're leaving so suddenly. Hey, I'm not all broken up about this, just so you know. I've changed a lot since I met you. I'm gonna try and figure out what I really want to do with my life. I know you can do it, Natsuki-chan. <laughs> Well, now I really feel like I gotta do it. No pressure, right? No. I got one last thing I want to say before I go. If you just accept the way things are, then you'll never move forward. Just like me. <sighs> so I hope you can figure out what you want, too. What I want, I... Uh... I used to try and please everyone, just to fit in. I was afraid of not being liked, so I always went along with the people around me. But I never really thought about what I wanted. <laughs> That's so you. Well, if they don't like you for who you are, I say screw them. But I like you, Fuka. Even if you hate yourself. Kichan. Well, I better get going. Huh? Uh. Huh? Not Kichan? Here, even if we're apart, we're still connected. So we can always talk, right? Thanks for being my friend. I'm kind of tearing up now. Natsuki-chan. Even if we're apart, we're still connected. <laughs> I get it now, Natsuki-chan. I'd always assumed my powers were a reflection of my faults. I was always worried about how other people see me. And that's why my powers let me see others. There is something I want after all. Seeing everyone getting along and working together makes me so happy. So, I want us to treasure this forever. I have the power to connect people, even when they're apart. My persona has given me this amazing gift. The friendship I've always wanted. Now her persona evolves. That's not creepy at all. The resolution of Fuka's heart has awakened a new persona. Fuka's persona Lucia has given rise to Juno. Grants one random enhanced positive effect to all allies. Okay, cool. There you are. Oh, what are you all doing here? It is unusual to find you up on the rooftop. Okay, I just wanted to say, uh, Natsuki, she she gave a lot of backhanded comments there. Like, uh, I, I'm not I'm not getting all turn up from this uh, from this goodbye. It's like that's that's not something you say. And it's like, oh yeah, I'm gonna be packing. I'm not gonna have time to hang out. Like, how much of a friend are you really if you're gonna say this kind of shit, you know what I mean? Even if you're like, trying to play it off cool... Come on. It's... That, that's... You, know, you don't do that shit. And how do you not know about a transfer? Like, how do you not know you're like a friend's transfer? Like... I get it, something sudden might have come up, but it's like... 
you would be torn up if someone's if someone's parent got into the hospital and you had to transfer you would be torn up and clearly she had other friends like she was talking to other people at the beginning of the game she was bullying Fuka wasn't she there were other people around I don't know it's just weird weird how they handled that uh, the dialogue choices not choices but like the dialogue they gave her it's just weird well, we didn't see you around, so we weren't sure if you were all right. I think I figured it out. Okay? I've made up my mind. I'm going to do everything I can with the power I've been given. This is what I've decided I want to do. I mean, is that what we're doing anyway? Um, sure? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Sorry. I guess that was out of nowhere, wasn't it? Uh, you sure you're all right? <laughs> I'm confused too. This is questionable. Fukasan said she figured it out. What do you think? I understand her. Affirmative. I saw the cutscene. I know what she means. Hey, I just heard that Moriyama's transferring. You know, the girl who's friends with Fuka. They haven't been friends for very long, though. Kinda sucks. Dude, the mall sucks. I was trying to pick up this girl, but some cop kept staring at me like he meant business. Yeah. Yeah, the mall sucks because of that. Zamp suck, man. People completely forgot about that guy, Aragaki, now that they're studying. Maybe they never cared about his death in the first place. I don't know what you mean. Alright, let's try Chihiro. Let's finally get her on our fucking list. Hello, um, the other day when you um, invited me out, I've been thinking, um, if it's okay with you, would you like, would you, um, like to, let's walk uh, home together. Yes. Uh, okay. Um, then I'll get ready to go. I'll go get ready. Is, is this, um, really okay? Are you sure you don't mind or anything? I mean, um, I'm glad you're willing to, uh, but, but... Just relax. Uh, oh, right. I, I'm not very good at talking to boys. There are a lot of guys in the student council, though, so I should work on that. Oh, the school is almost out. Let's go. Walked all the way to the dorm, neither of us saying a word. You might be interested in, Senpai, but I couldn't think of anything. This is Iwatodai Dorm, right? Do you live here? My house is in the other direction. Oh, I should have asked. No, it's not your fault. I noticed we were going in the wrong direction. I should have spoken up. Um, I know you took time out of your schedule just for me, so thank you very much for today. Chihiro seems to appreciate my company. I feel like we've gotten a little closer. Ah, uh, that. Justice. So we need to make sure we have a Justice Arcana now. Um, please excuse me. Okay. Let's see how much SP this shit gives oh, us. Welcome back.
Oh, wow. 50 SP. Okay, so definitely worth it. 100 HP to an ally, 50 SP to one ally. I will take it. Um, um, hey. So Natsuki-chan is moving away. I'm honestly really depressed about it. But I also know that no matter the distance, she'll always be right here with me. Nothing can come between the bond we share. So I'll be alright. Casinos are popular vacation spots nowadays, but for the real casino experience, you have to go to Las Vegas in the USA. We'll now hear from our foreign correspondent on the strip. Hello there. Hi, and welcome to Las Vegas, gambling capital of the world. I don't know why I gave her like a 1930s like uh, uh, hmm. accent. No. Um. Um. Oh. No more skills. Then what yes. use are you to me? Um. Let's do this guy. No, oh, yeah. Hey, guess what? I just borrowed some more of that manga from last time. I got way more volumes this time. Carrying the mole was a drag, though. Uh, you want to read some more of it? Sure. <laughs> oh yeah, it's what I like to hear. Man, our hero took an underdog baseball team that didn't even have enough players all the way to nationals. No matter how tough the rival or desperate the situation, the hero always ends up finding a way. Hey, we're technically a team too, aren't we? Means we need a hot shot of our own, right? You're onto something. <laughs> Don't sweat it. We've already got ourselves a major hot shot. Me. Everyone else has got their own strengths. Kind of like the characters in a manga. Either way, kind of blows that real life can't be like how it is in a manga. Anywho, on to the next page. Oh yeah, that's right. Just before the big game, the hero collapses. All after getting everyone together, training like crazy, becoming a hot shot hitter, and carrying the whole team all by himself. Young hero's dedication filled me with courage. Dying to know what happens next, huh? Then I'll borrow the rest of the volumes from my buddy, Ronto. Just under two weeks left. Someone's wandered into Tartarus. Good morning. This is Elizabeth. I am calling to inform you that more humans have wandered into Tartarus. Two this time, I believe, and there seems to be an acquaintance of yours among them. I suggest you carry out a rescue post haste. Goodbye now. It seems that someone I know is lost in Tartarus. It's already mid-October, and we're about two weeks away from the final battle. So much has happened, and it all went by so fast. But it made me realize, I'm so glad everyone welcomed me to the team. Thank you. I'm glad I met you, Fuka. Huh? Oh, um, I didn't think you'd say something like that. That means a lot to me. Thank you. Let's do our best in the final battle. Oh, Yukari. I'm finally done. I spent all of lunch cleaning up for the archery team, so I didn't have time to eat anything. Maybe I'll stop by Wakatsu or something on the way home. Seems Yukari wants to walk home with me. Yep, let's do it. Spend time mm -hmm. with Yukari. Kind of feels weird eating by myself, you know? Alright, let's get going. Hmm, what should I order? the right choice getting the same thing as you oh i was just thinking doesn't eating fish remind you of the ocean it's a part of our lives i guess living along the coast we even spent our vacation at the beach 
Hey, True. after all this is over, why don't we go somewhere different? Like the mountains. I love we the mountains. We could have lunch outdoors. Maybe we'll even see a deer or something. What do you think? Let's go just the two of us. Hold on. What's this all of a sudden? Just the two of us? I, I didn't mean it like that. I mean, it's not that I don't want to. It's just... I'm not ready yet. Oh god, what am I saying? Either way, um, I'm sure it'd be fun to hang out somewhere together. I could even make food for us. I might not look like it, but I'm a pretty good cook. Just you wait and see. I've tasted your food. <laughs> it's been a while since we've talked about going on vacation. I'm excited just thinking about it. I'm not sure how to say this, but when I'm with you, I don't feel so alone. I mean, I do have friends, and there's everybody at the dorm, but usually I feel like the real me is trapped somewhere deep down inside. Maybe it's because of my family situation, but I'm always pushing people away without realizing it. Lately, though, that's been changing, and I think it's thanks to you. Yukari is trusting in me. And I've planted the seeds for romance. Well, that was delicious. It's getting late. Shall we head out? I think it's around... I think it's level 8. Where you actually make this decision for every girl if you want to date them. Welcome back! And you totally can. There's nothing stopping you. Um... Especially in this game. In the original, anyway. I don't know if they've updated or anything. You can legitimately date every single girl with no repercussions. I think 4 and 5 added, like... You can do the same thing. You can date everyone. But there's, like, a cutscene near the end where, like... You know, acknowledges that. Uh, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm, I think I'll just stick with Yukari. Uh, it's been a lot more of the loss lately, huh? But there's only one shadow left. Once we destroy it, this whole thing will be over. Let's do it, man. Yes, let's. <laughs> yeah. Let's give everyone a reason to smile again. Or something cool like that. All right. Next full moon is approaching. Let's be prepared. I want to be able to give a successful report to Aragaki. Last night's increase in apathy syndrome victims hits, hit the previously predicted mark. It was off by a few days, but the cultural anthropologist's prediction came true again. They have announced their intentions to continue their research on... The news continues. And now, another missing persons report. College student Ryohei Nakatsugawa, 19, along with Maiko Uhashi, daughter of an office worker Takahiro Uhashi, 36, both have gone missing within a very short time frame. Police are searching for leads and ask the public for assistance. There's a possibility they may have wanted to charter us. Yeah, yeah. So I'm guessing the high school student is the person we know? Hey! Fuka's really changed, don't you think? She used to be so reserved, but now... I guess she's still kind of quiet, but she says a lot more open. She's a lot more open, you know? Hey! Everything will go back to normal once we defeat the next enemy. Honestly, it makes me feel a little sad, but an ordinary life is definitely better. I get to hang out with my friends and do stupid stuff together and meet Chidori more often. All right. I completely forgot about Chidori. Anyways, let's beat that final shadow six ways to Sunday, dude. Yeah, I'd completely forgotten about Chidori. <laughs> Yawn. He's yawning. He must be sleepy. What will, ha what will I do when the dark hour disappears? Hmm, I don't know. Guess I'll try to fix my sleeping habits. I always stay up really late on the nights we go to Tartarus. Maybe. You too, Koromaru? But you can sleep anytime you want, can't you? So I got a point. Well. What am I going to do when the dark hour disappears? Hmm, I don't know. I'll be sure to tell my mother and Aragaki-san about it, but... I guess I want to learn what it's like to be an ordinary elementary suit, school student. Yeah. 
Excuse me. I think we're done with all this stuff, right? Yeah. No. Oh. Okay, so let's uh I guess we just finish off the things that we have. The this stuff, the computer stuff. I guess we can do part-time master. Maybe this will raise our academics. Um. Yeah, let's do that one. Let me see what this URL leads to. Histories of the world's greatest. Looks like trivia on historical figures. Today's topic, leaders in battle. I think I'll read more about this. I read about the decisions historical leaders made in pursuit of their goals. I feel like I've learned how to maintain morale in the face of, of adversity. Ambush has been enhanced. After successfully attacking an enemy from behind, your theory gauge will rise. Oh, fucking A. That's cool. I like that. Attention, please. Just compare the names used for months in Japanese and English. The latter is a mess. October is 10th? Come on now. So everyone knows about Julius Caesar, right? Well, it's just not it's not just his fault that the English names for months are off. Did you know that his name is actually the origin of the word July? Many people and gods have had their names used this way throughout history. Isn't it interesting to see how a person can affect entire languages? Well then. Here's a question, Makoto. Which Roman goddess has been theorized as a namesake for the month of April? Um, that is a good question. Uh, I don't know if these are actually goddesses' names. A uh, Roman goddess's name, sorry. I know Venus is. I'll go with Venus. It's the only one I know. That's actually a Roman goddess. Yes, you got it. That was a tough one. Some have speculated that April was originally called Aphrilis, after named after Aphrodite, the Greek name for the goddess Venus. Others believe it may have it may be derived from a Latin verb meaning to open. They argue that April is the beginning of the season where flowers and other plants begin to open up. I, however, prefer my word origins to have a bit more of a romantic flair. Here's another example. I'm sorry, I was just thinking. I was considering what I might stand to gain from attending school. But I suppose nothing will come of this line of thought. It's not something I should entertain. Nope. No high essay. Oh, hey there. Heading home? I was thinking of going out somewhere first. Let's do it. Oh, you're coming too? Great. Let's head to Polonia Mall then. There were a few things I wanted to check out. Hey, mind if I go take a look at some earrings? I've been wanting new ones, but I can never seem to make up my mind. They're all so cute, you know? There are too many options to choose from. I know. Why don't you come help me pick something out? All right. Let's go. Is it Mama? Hang on, I've got a call. Hello? Uh huh. <laughs> what? You're not doing it? You want my approval first? Wait, it's fine. You can do what you want to do. <sighs> what I mean is, if that's what you really want, then go ahead. It's your choice, so. You really don't have to worry about me. 
Well, then, you want to meet up and talk about it? <sighs> hey, stop it. Don't cry. I'll try to call you more, too, okay? All right. Bye. <sighs> that was my mom. She apologized for everything that's happened. She said she won't get remarried until I'm okay with it. Random. That's weird. I can't stop shaking for some reason. Can we sit for a while? I sat down with Yukari until she calmed down. Sorry about all that. I'm fine now. I was just surprised. I never expected this to happen. I told her we could meet up and talk about her remarriage. I'm nervous just thinking about it. Do you want to see her? I don't exactly want to. I'm afraid it might get ugly. We haven't seen each other in almost 10 years. Wow. So it's not going to be easy. I'm afraid I'll get angry and say something cruel. Still, I think it's time I try talking to her. I've been saying how wrong it is to run away. So I need to live up to my own advice. You know, I think she still misses my dad deep down, but she couldn't handle it. Losing someone so important to her. That's why she needed someone to lean on. I think losing someone you love and having to go on alone is really, really hard. I'm not sure how to explain, but I realized this after being with you. I think being in love means giving a part of yourself away. And that's a wonderful thing. <laughs> I mean, just in general, you know? Ikari's feelings are coming out. Seems we've grown closer. Maybe it's rank 9 I was thinking of. Not rank 8. The earrings can wait till next time. Let's just go home for today. I see you're back. Leader. When cornered, an enemy will fight even more fiercely. This is a basic premise of warfare. Only one shadow remains. We should expect the same principle to apply here as well. I am sure that this will be the toughest battle. I have battle. a suggestion. Please make sure that you are fully prepared so that we do not experience an unfortunate defeat. Hello. Well, your exams are over now, so we should focus on the task at hand. Only one shadow remains. This will be the final battle. The fate of this town rests in your hands. I believe in you. Good luck. Yo. I made some changes to my training regimen recently. I had heard that imagining someone watching your back while you work out is supposed to be effective. I had my doubts at first, but it turns out it works pretty well. That's good to know. Hey! Fuka's really changed, hasn't she? I wonder if it's because Moriyama's moving out of town. Then again, wouldn't you normally feel down when that happens? Man, I just don't get girls. By the way, I received a compliment from Mikutsuki-san the other day. He told me I was doing well for an elementary school student. That made me really happy. Good for you. Good for you. I think we're done um, with the reading. Say. Yeah. Um, no. Not now. Sorry. Uh. Okay, Takemi's not there. Uh, no, sorry. Uh, first launch. First floor launch. Guess I will do this. Let's do... Yeah, muscle trainer, I guess. Image muscle trainer. It looks like software that stimulates muscles through image training. Now watch these strength training videos and imagine yourself participating. I watch the videos and picture myself working out of my head. For some reason, I feel as exhausted as if I actually did the training. I feel like the image training may have actually strengthened my muscles. If only that would work.
And so... Masamun Dat's date, I'm gonna say date, decided to pursue Hideyoshi Toyo Toyotomi, so he, did, so he headed for Odawara. Can you feel his heart-rending... Can you feel his heart-rending sorrow that came from such a decision? Oh, I wish I was bored in that area. A era. Area. I can't... Sorry, I guess my mind's starting to shut off or something. I could have fought alongside Masamun Date. Alright, now this turns into a real wild ride from here on. Blink and you might miss something. No, stay awake. Gotta Glad max to out your, your academics. Ah, the Sengoku era. The days when men were in their full glory. This modern age is terrible. Where's the samurai spirit gone? Now let's review what we've covered on the Sengoku era. First thing, no era was ever better. Secondly... Man, we were really behind in academics. I, I seriously thought we would have maxed out by now. But it's all good. Alright, let's talk to Hayase. Yo. I was feeling hungry, but I wanted to wait for you. I was hoping we could eat together. Yeah. Let's do it. Cool, let's go. Let's get some takoyaki today. I want some fresh off the stove. Mm. This is so good. I am so lucky I get to eat such amazing food. Should I bring some home? If I do, I'd have to pay for it. Hmm. I can spy you some cash. <laughs> it's fine. I should be able to cover it. Oh, by the way, about my mom. She's gonna be out of the hospital soon. Just when I was finally getting the hang of taking care of everyone myself. And guess what else? My teammates offered to help me with the kids too. They even said they picked my sister up from preschool. I guess everyone's been worried about me. That's cool. And there I was, total tunnel vision. Trying to do everything on my own. In the end, maybe it was my fault the team couldn't work together. Don't sweat it. <laughs> Honestly, that's reassuring to hear from you. I feel a lot better about everything now that I know how everyone really feels. I'm having fun just running laps. My body feels light as a feather now. Oops. Guess I kind of started rambling there. Sorry, but I gotta get going. Take it easy. And don't forget, I'm only able to focus on training again because you had my back. And I feel great, so... Thanks, buddy. I say really spoke from the heart. That's cool, man. Later! I decided to go back to the dorm. Oh, welcome back. Number of loss keeps increasing. It's like everywhere I go, there's a reminder that we still need to fight shadows. But we just have to beat one more, and we'll be fi we'll finally be done. Um By the way, sometimes when I'm surfing the web, I like to think about how the internet can help us form bonds with other people. We normally don't pay it any mind, but we connect to others and form bonds when searching for information online. Sorry. Oh, sorry. That was pretty random, wasn't it? I just wanted to share my thoughts with someone. Hmm. Is it just me, or... Sonata sound kind of different now. Like, he doesn't feel the same as before. You're right. Hey, not bad! After everything that's happened, he didn't lose hope. Said he's all fired up. Aragaki-san was amazing, yeah, but so was Sonata-san. They're like the definition of a dynamic duo. I wish I could be as strong as them one day. Oh yeah. Uh, nope. Um. 
And I think I have a couple of days until I put, uh, put the Tayak in the fridge. 25, yeah, literally two days. We'd like to apologize for our last report, saying our apathy syndrome victims had overrun the mall. In light of the higher number of viewer complaints, the reporter responsible has been suspended. Oof. It's a little bit harsh, don't you think? Uh, uh, no new skills. Check the neck cafe again. Come on. Yeah, this is Come again. Um, and then let's go to Club Escapade. Do you worry about your exam scores? Uh no, I don't. Great, that's how it's supposed to be. Guess I'm new. Go have a look for yourself. Veggie blog. What's that? Eh? Saved in a while, man. Yeah. And I think that'll do it for this episode. We um, got quite a quite a lot of story regarding uh, Amada, Fuka, and um, yeah, we, we worked on quite a bit of social links. Uh, we're starting to we're starting to go through them slowly. Um, yeah, next time. Uh, We'll basically be working our way up to going to Tartarus. Uh, probably like another week left. Um, and yeah, we'll wait for that uh, for the final person to wander into Tartarus, and then we'll head in there ourselves. And then we're literally just yeah, as a as I said, like about a week away from the final shadow, and we'll see how it goes from there. As I mentioned. Um, there's still quite a bit of story afterwards. I, I guess it's kind of minor spoilers, but we're, we're not done yet at that point. But hopefully you guys are looking forward to it. Uh, trust me, lots of different story content that you have, you guys have no idea. And I hope, yeah, hope you guys are looking forward to that. In the meantime... Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Take care.